So what is the meaning of memory? Ability to recall and recognize what we have learned previously. I am repeating. So the ability to dig the information or recall the information or recognize the information what we have learned. For example, PIE, Perspectives in Education. In Perspectives in Education, some important milestones are there in the history of Indian education. See, before Christ, some schools were prevailing, that is Vedic education, followed by Jainism, followed by Buddhism. So Vedic education is based on Vedas. There are four Vedas, Rugveda, Yajurveda, Samaveda, Adarvana Veda. So after completion of Vedas, Vedangas or Upanishads emerged. So if you understand Indian philosophy, there were two major classifications, Orthodox and Unorthodox. So this Jainism and Buddhism, Charvaka, come under Orthodox. So they are against of the ultimate power or supreme power of Vedas. You know Jainism, Buddhism, Charvaka. Followed by Orthodox philosophy which consists of Nyaya, Sankhya. Sankhya is the oldest philosophy. Followed by Yoga, Vaisheshika. Followed by Purva Mimamsa. Purva Mimamsa followed by Uttar Mimamsa. Uttar Mimamsa is also called Vedanta. Again, it can be classified into different types. Dvaita, Advaita, Vishishta, Advaita. Just I am giving example for memory. So what is the meaning of memory? Ability to recall and recognize the past experiences. I would like to demonstrate my memory power regarding the perspectives in education in terms of chronological order or important years and milestones in the history of Indian education. Look at the board. 1712, Arabs attacked India. Followed by 1192, the first maktab established by Muhammad Ghori. 1498, Vasco de Gama discovered sea route to India. Followed by 1575, the first college St. Anne's was started by St. Francis Xavier. 1716, the first teacher training college was started by G. Jan Ball. 1792, observation book was published by Charles Grant. 1813, Charter Act, 1835 Mekala Minutes. This is very important for English teacher job aspirants. Because of the Mekala report, English language came into existence as a medium of instruction replaced with Sanskrit in Indian schools. Followed by 1854 Woods Dispatch, 1882 Hunter Commission, 1902 University Education Commission, 1904 University Education Act, 1910 Gopala Krishna Gokale introduced two bills in Imperial Legislative Council, 1917 Sadar Commission, 1920 Central Advisory Board of Education was started, 1927 Simon Commission, 1929 Harta Committee, 1937 Abbott Wood Report, 1937 Basic Education, 1944 Sargent Report. These committees commissions are related to British education system. After post-independence, some important committees, commissions are there. 1948 Radha Krishnan Commission, 1951 BG Care Committee, 1952 Modiliar Commission, 1953 UGC, 1955 G Ramachandran Committee, 1957 National Commission and Women, Committee on Women Education, 1959 Sri Prakasha Committee, 1961 NCRT Establishment, 1962 Hans Mehta Committee, 1963 Bhaktavachalam Committee, 1964 Kotari Commission, 1964 Report of Kotari Commission, 1968 the first national educational policy, 1971 the first residential school in United AP, 1974 Integrated Education from Disabled Children, IEDC program, 1975 the first national curriculum framework 
1977 ईश्वर बाय पटेल कमिटी 1978 मालकम आदिशेष कमिटी 1971 नीपा 1982 अंबेडकर ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी 1983 चटोपदे कमिशन ऑन वुमेन टीचर एजुकेशन 1984 CIET 1985 SIET एंड इग्नो 1986 न्यू एजुकेशनल पॉलिसी 1988 Adult Education Program, 1989 National Institute of Open Schooling, 1990 Achara Ramurthy Committee, 1992 N Janardhan Reddy Committee, 1993 Establishment of NCTE, 1994 National Assessment and Accreditation Council, 1995 Koner Ramakrishna Rao Committee Report, 2001 Sarva Sikh Shyamian, 2002 86th Constitutional Amendment. 2003 national program for education of elementary education of girls 2003 kasturba gandhi balika vidyalaya kgbv 2004 2003 and 2004 kasturba gandhi balika vidyalaya 2005 fourth national curriculum framework 2008 model schools 2009 rashtriya madhyamika shiksha abhiyan and sakshara bharat program 2010 code of ethics for teachers 2013 rashtriya uchhataran shiksha abhiyan followed by 2014 2015 beti bachao beti padao pade bharat bade bharat 2016 in 2016 tsr subramanyam committee report 2017 So National Testing Agency was started. 2018 Samagra Shiksha Abhiyan. 2020 National Education Policy. 2023 the fifth National Curriculum Framework. That is National Curriculum Framework for Secondary Education. So these are important milestones in the history of Indian education. So this is memory power. So if you want this type of memory power to crack your DSE, so try to install Emily Academy mobile app. and follow my psychology classes and perspective and education classes <music>